hey guys welcome back to my channel so today's project is at random so most of the things that we're doing in our backyard is small projects that we plan to do but it's doing at random basically if we get the time to do it or time allows to do whatever that's how we get it done so today I'm gonna show you what we're working on and what we did yesterday um, the video you just saw is basically a continuation in this area the same we're working in the same area and in the backyard so again at random as time time allows so I'm gonna turn the camera around and show you guys what we're working on today okay so yesterday we took care of trimming these shrubs when I step back let me see if I could stretch it out okay so this is where we started and then the trimmer went out and then we had to use the smaller um, shaker trimmer to do these three right here now as you can see it's kind of it's not even this one is lower than these two now the reason this one is lower is because it haven't grew enough and we had to still trim it off in order to have like um a cemetery to the top like it was it was not it although it had the growth it, it looks really like thin at the top so we still had to cut it off in order to have some sort of cemetery somewhat cemetery because as you can see again it's not even but we got a lot of it done I know you guys can hear a lot of noise a lot of people are in the yard they're cutting grass they're doing trimming so that's where the noise is coming from so sorry about that hopefully you can hear me and this video is not as noisy so again we finish here what we need to do is mulch the bottom I believe we may start that today and move our way through all of this here now we do have to mulch this bed I wanted to make sure that the irrigation was working but we haven't turned on the irrigation to know what's going on with the irrigation so I'm still gonna mulch it if we run into problems later at least I know I can still find it and pull it up and see what's going on but I believe we may mulch this area today it's about um, 6 in the evening so hopefully um, with everything we're doing we still have enough light to continue this process I would like to finish it today but I don't know what's gonna happen now I'm going over here where my husband is at because we started laying bricks let me get over there so I can show you so in one of my past videos I spoke about this area that we created um, joining the pollinated bed and this one with the arborvitaes and we decided to join it together um, but what we did was outline it with the bricks we first used the black edging as you can see it in between here and then we put the bricks on the outside now the black edging is gonna help us contain whatever weed is growing out here is gonna help us with that and we're gonna lay cardboard and stuff to put mulch it as we go along so as you can see let me step back that look beautiful doesn't it a nice creation just imagine use the imagination once the mulch goes in here and then we just started this was supposed to be the shade garden bed but since my neighbor cut her trees I'm not sure if it's still considered a shade garden bed or if it's gonna be like part sun part shade because I do have some trees in here as well but it's not as big and so I want to wait for a lot of these things to full out you know the leaves and stuff is on it so I can see what kind of shade this area is getting before I start you know plugging anything in here as you can see my husband is lining it with the bricks now this area here is part of this area gets a lot of water when rain and stuff comes so I'm gonna kind of lift it up with the um, 
maybe some compost or with mulch or I don't know how I'm gonna do it but anyway we're lining it with the bricks so we have you know the cemetery straight here and then over here you want to have that neat clean crisp look so that's what we're doing over here what I'm gonna do is set up the camera so you can see as he laid the bricks and we're gonna get all this working okay so I want to come here so you can see it just kind of come out a little bit instead of completely straight it just come out a little bit but is that an easy fix yes do I want to try to fix it now no <laughs> so this basically all these garden space just gives me more places to plant more plants which is exciting you know when you can have the space to plant it's very exciting you know so this end is finished now I'm gonna walk down here because I'm gonna show you what my plan is to the very end so this is all my flower bed and when you get down here I want to use like from this corner here with the irrigation going back this way I'm gonna also use it to plant vegetables so instead of putting more flowers over here i'm gonna insert some flowers because this vegetable is gonna be between here but i'm also gonna plant some vegetables going back this way because this tree these tree the crepe myrtles end right here so i'm gonna use this area going all the way back as my flower bed and just this corner here is where i'm gonna be using for vegetables now this was a, a one of the floodlights and it went out uh, when we just moved in I think we mowed into it and something happened and it never came back on we didn't try to fix it or anything we just left it alone so I think I'm gonna just put my mulch and stuff over that and not worry about that because we do we do we need it possibly yes do we use it no is it gonna work we gotta do a whole lot to make sure that works so um 
I'm not worried about that. That is out of the picture. But just look at this over here and over there. When you plant, it's going to look so beautiful. I am going to be enjoying my backyard and my front yard. And now let me show you. I'm creating another area right over here. That I have some shrubs. Creating a small area right here. And let's see how this goes. Okay guys, so it is late now and we just finished mulching all around here. We started at the top here and then we go around and finish all the way around here so all this is finished once you put the mulch down you can see all the open spots which is not too bad because there's a lot of plants in this bed and you want to give them enough space to grow so I have a plant for back there and like I said I think I'm gonna tuck like annuals nice flower and stuff back here because I want to see um, some flowers back here versus just all the greenery green and purple green purple and yellow you know tuck some flowers back here over here looks so nice can't wait for that to come up I gotta fertilize my grapes is back there and I'm gonna top it up with some compost and give it some fertilizer to help my grapes over here in these two corn in this little corner here is two hydrangea and I got there done now the places I got to work on is over here but a lot of weeds we got to clean out here this is the bed we also created we got to clean it out put the cardboard and then put um, put the soil in there but what I got to do is uh, finish out here with the blocks I gotta do over here time time little bit each day and then back here again we gotta work on the entire back here cleaning it out and put in um, uh, not compost oh god you guys know what I mean my my brain is tired that thing over there <laughs> oh god oh, put in some more mulch we gotta put mulch in this bed my my brain is tired oh my god and like i said it's late we came home from work and started doing this so yeah my brain is tired and then we gotta work on this these beds are taking a lot of mulch a lot a lot of mulch we already with the beds that we're finishing and the little bit of mulch that is sitting in the grass we already went through two pallets of mulch that's a lot of mulch anyway anyway back here look messy but in time i will say give me a couple more days to get this nicely cleaned up we're gonna get rid of all this i'm i'm I might just plant up these two pots right here, you know, 
uh, I gotta do a lot. I also gotta take care on top of my patio. I gotta get that clean, bring out my patio furniture, stuff like that. I got a lot going on back here, guys, but it's coming together. It's coming together slowly and looking really nice. Uh, I gotta refresh these two beds, the two um, vegetable beds. Um, yeah, I got a lot going on. The greenhouse, we gotta put the roof in there and clean that out so I can move some of my stuff back in there because I have it in my house. So slowly but surely, <sighs> slowly but surely, Anyway, I guess the process continues tomorrow. You guys have an amazing evening. Hope you get a chance to do something amazing, something beautiful. And I will catch you all in my next video. Bye for now.